everybody doing? I just wanted to answer a couple questions that continually come in and the question that's always asked is how do I maintain a 100% plant-based diet? And the answer is pretty simple for me. I am able to maintain a 100% plant-based diet because I am conscious. Because I am conscious and aware of who I am and what I'm made of. And I'm also conscious and aware of the world of the planet that I exist in. And this planet has a lot of things to offer me. I can hike, I can run, I can camp, I can jog, I can travel. I mean, the list goes on and on. I'm one of those outdoor guys. Like, I love being outdoors. The wilderness, oh, I love the wilderness. But if I didn't maintain my system correctly and put the right foods into my system, my body would break down. I know this because there are examples every 10 feet. There are people everywhere. A hospital is full of those people. We see these people every single day when we step outside. People are overweight, they're lethargic, they're depressed, they're down, they've got low self-esteem, inferiority complexes, and it's diet-based. And those are not the people that are out there running marathons. Those are not the people out there doing triathlons. Those are pe not the people out there riding the divide. You know what I'm saying? And these are things that I like to do. So I eat a plant-based diet because I'm really excited to be alive. Like, I'm stoked. And if you really look at the percentage or the chances of me being on this planet, based upon the vastness of everything else around it, I mean, those odds are pretty, pretty impossible. And here I am in a vehicle that allows me to experience all those amazing things like running and hiking and camping and so forth. Like, it's a blessing that I'm here. And this is not a discount body. It's not a discount body at all. And it never will be. So I treat it like a premium, you know, like, this is my car and I'm using super unleaded all day long to fuel this vehicle so that I can go out and do everything that I want to do. This car is important to me. This one right here. And the only way I can do that is if I maintain it properly, because if I put the wrong gas in it, it's going to break down and the gas being the food. If I put the burgers in me, if I put the steaks in me, if I put the fast food in me, if I put the cooked food in me, my body is going to break down. You guys have seen some of the videos I've done on acrylamide, carrageenan, NutraSweet, like that's in all the food out there that you pick up at the supermarket, you take home, you bake, you cook, you fry, you barbecue. The preservatives, the artificial colors, the artificial flavoring, like that is not my friend. Organic is my friend. Plant-based is my friend. And I don't put anything into my body that's controversial. If there's a controversy around it, it ain't going in my body. And I've never seen anyone die from eating a banana. I've never seen anyone die from eating a head of lettuce, some cabbage, seeds of nuts, germinated. Like, I've never seen anyone die from that. I've never seen anyone experience a medical condition. And quite the contrary, I've seen people move to a plant-based diet during their hardest times in life and completely become clear and healthy within just a matter of months. So the proof is in the plant-based pudding in this case, you know what I'm saying? So I put the right fuel into my body so that I can continue to do the things that I enjoy and get the most out of this life. And I don't ever want to put myself in a position by eating bad to where I have to take some type of medication or pharmaceuticals or worry about when I travel where the nearest doctor is. That's not my idea of a good time. My idea of a good time is the time I'm having now. And don't get me wrong, you know, I've been eating a plant-based diet for the most part for the last 13 years of my life. And there's a lot of you that know me personally, and I'm a testament to that, yeah? I mean, the way I look, the way I feel, the way I act, everything. I haven't experienced as much as a common cold in over 13 years. I don't even remember what a cold is. I don't experience allergies. I don't experience the flu. I don't experience sickness. And I'm not taking flu shots or anything. I'm just eating right. It's really that simple. It's so simple. No one wants to believe it. But you got me. And I'm telling you, it's that simple. Believe it. Here I am. So what an amazing life this can be. And I, 
again, I haven't always been like this. I used to be the guy that was like, oh, I don't want to get out of bed today because if I get out of bed, I'm not working. And if I'm not working, I'm going to spend money and I'm going to spend money I don't have. I was depressed. You know, I used to smoke cigarettes. How disgusting is that? I was ingesting polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons like they were going out of style. I think in one puff of a cigarette, roughly, it's one trillion free radicals entering the body. Like, that's what I subjected myself to when I was younger. And that's disgusting, right? Like, and then one day I woke up and said, hey, I got a choice. I can be everything I want to be and get everything I want out of this life, or I can just drive myself into the grave and then try and find satisfaction in other areas like sympathy from people. But that was not the route I chose. Plant-based diet, 100%. And that's what works for me. So that's how I'm able to do it. I'm aware and I'm conscious of myself and the planet. So hope that answers it. Thanks for watching. Again, Burt Bryant. Um, if you get a chance, you like the videos, subscribe to the YouTube channel. That'd be really awesome. Give us a thumbs up and definitely visit our website. It's planet earth. That's planet I R T H earth.com. And there's a bunch of articles that we write up there. We try and keep that updated as much as possible. And those are usually pertaining to the questions that are asked. So a lot of good information there. So thanks again for watching. I'm going to take my green juice, finish it. You guys have a wonderful day. Thanks.